Okay. See, we are on the first place. Okay. As soon as you switch on the machine, switch off. Okay. Now you switch on the machine. Green light will come here. Okay. That indicates your machine is on. Okay. Yes. It will take some time to give the display. So be patient and wait. Okay, so now the display says therapy wizard, electrotherapy, feedback therapy, and system setting. Okay, the system setting means like symmetrical. No, this went to electrotherapy. One minute. This is back button. Okay, the systems setting. That means language the brightness of the screen, mm -hmm. the volume of the speaker, okay, any default setting, how much is the EMG you want, okay, all the system related, the system related information. For going back, okay, you have to move this. Yes. When you move this, the, it will change the places. Now go to here and press this, you will go back. Okay. Now next one is electrotherapy. Okay, press electrotherapy. In the electrotherapy, you have pain management, muscle stimulation, all current waveforms and diagnostics. So, depends upon what you want. For example, a patient comes for pain. Okay, you want to apply some current which is related to pain. So, what you have to press is press pain management. And you select what type of current you want. You want pre-modulated, you want four polar, you want biphasic, you want faradic. Depends upon the current what you want, you can select. Okay. okay. Next one is again go back. Now this one is to stimulate the muscle. Which yes. are the best current to stimulate the muscle? So here these currents. For pain means you have more list. Okay. For stimulation only these currents are very important for stimulation. Paradic, Russian, biphasic, tense. Okay. Didynamic and high voltage. Okay. These are the stimulation currents. Next again go back. All currents means whatever for pain, for stimulation, whatever the currents are there in this machine, all currents will be displayed. Okay? So, just try to remember the currents. One is Russian current. Okay? Second is interferential current. Okay? Third one is tense current. Okay? Fourth one is faradic. Fifth one is didynamic. Sixth one is galvanic. Okay? These are the different currents which you are going to apply to the patient. Okay? Everything has one one class. Faradic will deal in one class. Galonic will deal in one class. Russian will deal in one class. Like last year how you did indications, contraindications, uses, all those things you read about this particular currents. Okay? Now again, go back. Diagnostics means if you want to diagnose any problem for any patient, whether this muzzle has now supply or not. Okay? Whether this muscle is partially cut. Okay? So like that diagnosis and all you can do in this particular thing. For that you require different settings here. Okay? This is the diagnostic setting. Now we will select any one current and we will see. We will go to all current waveforms. We will go to Faradic current. Okay? Now in Faradic you have five types of currents. Okay? This is direct okay that is called trebet current okay direct and trebet current this is direct rectangular okay this is rectangular alternating this is triangular again direct this is triangular alternating so what is the difference between direct and alternating current okay imagine this is negative cathode okay Imagine this is anode. Okay? That means positive. Electric current means from the cathode, the electrons will come and go to the anode. Okay? This is direct. 
So the direction of the current is only single direction. Okay, from cathode to anode. Alternating means for one second or few amount of time, the current will come from cathode to anode. Okay, after some time, the polarity will reverse. That means this will become cathode, this will become anode. So current will come this direction. After some time, again, this will become cathode, this will become anode. So current will come to this direction. So if you draw the graph, the direct is only positive to negative. That's it. Okay. The alternating one is go to positive to negative, then negative to positive, then positive to negative. It will be like a curve. Okay. That will be alternating curve. That's what you are seeing here also. See, alternating means... There is a first one rectangle, then down also another rectangle. That means it is alternating. If you see only one rectangle, that means it is direct. Okay? So rectangular direct, rectangular alternating. Triangular direct, triangular alternating. Okay? So this is Faraday current. So now I can select one current. I will select rectangular alternating. Okay? Now it will ask whether you want 1 plus 2. That means 1 plus 2. 1 plus 2 means 4 electrodes you want or you one, want uh, 1 only? 1 all this. Okay, well, this is all 1. Yeah. Okay, this is all 2. Okay, 1 plus 2 means all this. 2 plus 2, 4 electrodes. Okay, 2 means only this 2. Okay, 1 means only this 1. So, I will select 1. Okay, now rectangular alternating current. Treatment time. How much I want? Okay, I can set the time. Okay. Every current has its own time. Okay, we'll discuss that later. This is just example. For example, 10 minutes. Okay. Electrode selection. Okay, now go to electrode selection. What kind of electrode you want? You want plate electrode or carbon rubber electrode or you want vacuum electrode? Okay. This is carbon rubber. Okay. This is vacuum. vacuum. Okay, so it will ask what electrode you want. If you say, see the symbol of vacuum. Please, doctor. Okay. Uh, this is carbon, carbon rubber. rubber, metal, pen electrode. All these are here. Oh. Only for vacuum, separate. Oh. Okay. So it will ask which kind of electro electrical current you want. So if you want, say, carbon rubber. Okay, that is selected. Now phase duration. Each phase of the current, how much you want? 1 millisecond, 2 milliseconds, it will ask. Phase interval means from one phase to another phase. How much gap you want? How much rest you want? Okay, that is phase interval. 